Okay, here we are. Going to show how to set up the Fat Shark FPV goggle 5.8 gigahertz system. I'm sure the 2.4 is the same setup, but since I'm running a 2.4 on my transmitter and receiver for my quadcopter here, Gowie 500X. I'm going to run a 5.8 here, but that's besides the point. Anyways, here we go. What you get with your fat sharks are this cord with red, black, yellow, white, and green, and this cord, which is your battery cord for a 2S uh, 7.5, 7 7.4 volt battery, and I'm using an 800 milliamp battery for that. And I'll put a link to that in the description. Uh, that's basically what you need for the Fat Shark. And then I also bought this cable from Ready Made RC. This cable plugs directly into the GoPro. And that is your video and audio out. So basically what happens is you take the Fat Shark cable and the only colors you use are white, yellow, and black and basically take them and connect them to this ready-made RC cable. Uh, you don't need to use the red cable on this ready-made RC. You just use the white goes to white, that's your audio. Your orange goes to yellow, that's your video. And then your brown goes to black, and that's your ground. It'll have a little tab when you get it, with uh, wires going to all these little black tabs. I just cut those tabs off, twisted them together, shrink wrapped them, and then put some electrical tape over it. Good to go. So once that's done, that's the hardest part, then that can get plugged in right here. This end plugs directly into the Fat Shark transmitter, like such. Then this end right here also plugs into the transmitter, like such. Then take your battery, plop that in there, and you can see there's a light shining. That means it's on. I already have my GoPro on. Now I'll set up these. I love this goggle. Easy. No fuss, no muss. The battery in. Turn the power on. Set it to norm on the goggle. And then you're seeing what the camera sees. Probably can't see real well right there, but try to uh try to get some different action. Just trust me, it works. I think that should work for all kinds of systems, all kinds of gigahertz systems. So, there you go. Have at it.